Twilight 2000 was a post-apocalyptic role-playing game created in 1984 by the highly prolific Game Designers Workshop. The same people that created Traveller, Space 1889 and Dark Conspiracy, amongst others. It won the 1984 Origins Award for Best Role-Playing Game, the same year its creator was inducted into the Adventure Gaming Hall of Fame. There were three editions, with more than 40 supplements. It was a very gritty game with a lot of rules front and centre. International reviewers of the time were quite critical of the way Europe was portrayed. So the most European of European publishers, Fria Ligen, based in Sweden, decided to reboot it 35 years after the original was published, and 20 years after the period the game is set in. It is currently available as a PDF print yourself from Drive Through RPG or as a box set from wherever RPGs are sold. The digital version will come with all the paper materials found in the hard copy, but the box set includes dice, custom dice. RPGs in the 1980s were very rules focused, barely distinct from war games of the time, and although this update benefits from a complete rules overhaul, it is still the kind of game that has hexes, counters, battle mats, and instead of a games master or storyteller, it has a referee. But, as with all games, you can chuck out as many rules as you like, along with any babies or bathwater you may find in the box, and play it entirely in the imagination. The core rules build on the Year Zero engine, but are heavily adapted to prioritise the gear and gritty realism of the setting. Basically, you gain one die from your skill you are using, and one from the attribute that is connected to the skill. The better you are, the larger the die, ranging from 6-sided to 12-sided. You succeed if either of the dice rolled has a 6 or higher showing. You don't add them together. This being a free league game, there is beautiful artwork both as splash pages for the chapter breaks and full colour illustrations throughout, not forgetting the highly realistic maps and fantastic looking battle mats, as well as in-character handouts explaining the story so far. This edition keeps the traditional Polish theatre of operations, perfect for nostalgia buffs, but also introduces a Swedish setting for anyone still having flashbacks about what went down in Krakow. The Free League website has all the materials available now, including extra dice and extra players' handbooks to make your game run smoother.